for joining us on a, on yet another debate night in America, Democratic debate number four from Columbus, Ohio, hosted by fake news CNN and the failing New York Times. Twelve Democrats took to the stage to angrily agree with each other for hours. Um, Ohio is a state where Democrats hope will s swing back their way, and tonight there are a lot of candidates with a lot to say. The main point I want to make... That is not is that working for Americans doing, across this so country. It works know, great but all the 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 are it works great the the is the is the is because in this The debate is back right after this short break. Yeah, well, hold on a minute. Why, Arthur... Why are there 12 candidates in the debate now? Last debate, there were 10. You can't subtract candidates and then add some back. Have you ever watched a reality show or sports? You don't go to the final four and then suddenly you're back to the elite eight. It's not... <laughs> it's not the way it works. Amy Klobuchar is still... She's eight laps behind and stopped to have lunch. She's still in the race. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. They need to pare this down. It's like the menu at the Cheesecake Factory. There's too much to choose from. It's... <laughs> Let's go through the uh, Cheesecake Factory menu and the candidates. Joe Biden is the old-fashioned burger. Uh, Elizabeth Warren is the super antioxidant salad, because it seems kind of good, but also like it's trying a little bit too hard. Bernie, uh, chicken salad sandwich all over your chin. <laughs> Mayor Pete is the children's brunch. <laughs> Beto O'Rourke and Andrew Yang are the roadside sliders. They're always falling off their skateboards. <laughs> Cory Booker is a uh, shrimp with angel hair. Hold the angel hair. Amy Klobuchar. <laughs> Amy Klobuchar is Renee's special because nobody knows who Renee is either. <laughs> Tulsi Gabbard is the luau salad, Hawaiian and mostly nuts. Kamala Harris, <laughs> avocado toast from California and toast. Julian Castro is the Baja Chicken Tacos because he's mildly spicy and he's a twin, so you get two. Uh, Tom Steyer is the Impossible Burger because th those are his chances of winning, and they're all trying to defeat the world-famous pumpkin cheesecake Donald Trump. And as if those weren't enough candidates, the former mayor of New York, Michael Bloomberg, is said to be thinking about running. I didn't know if you could still... You could still run, but if Joe Biden drops out, Bloomberg, they say, may swoop in. Michael Bloomberg is 77. Imagine being that old, still not knowing what you want to do with your life. That's... <laughs> Congratulations on making it to the end of a YouTube video. Why not celebrate by clicking the subscribe button? You earned it.